Hey y'all, Mike here from allamerican.org and today we're talking about how to find bedding made in the USA. We spend something ridiculous like a third of our lifetime sleeping, so you might as well have something that's super high quality that you really enjoy and is going to last you a very long time when it comes to your bedding products. So today we're talking about how to find bedding that's made in the USA, some of the top brands out there that are producing domestically made stuff and exposing some of the big brands in the bedding industry and where they're actually made. Now per usual, we've also written about this exact same topic, so check the links in the description below for stuff like bedding made in the USA, comforters, duvets, and a bunch of other research that we've done. And if you like buying American made stuff, make sure to like and subscribe and head over to allamerican.org. There you're gonna find all of our research, news, buying guides, everything else on supporting American manufacturing. Okay, let's get into today's video on how to find bedding made in the USA. So let's cover some tips real quick on material sourcing before we jump into some of those top brands. I wanna to touch on a few popular materials that are used in a lot of bedding products and really just how to spot the American made stuff. So one of the most popular materials we're gonna start off with is cotton. Now I've talked about cotton at length on this channel, so I won't go too deep uh, into all of the specific statistics, but there is a lot of really good American sourcing options for cotton in the US, so you should have no problem finding brands that are sourcing all of their cotton materials in the US. That being said, the US is not the global producer of cotton. Uh, that belongs to China, India, and some other countries but you should be able to find good sourcing options for this material. Next up is polyester. You'll find this in a lot of liners for things like duvet covers. The US is a big producer of polyester fibers and polyester blends, but it's behind China, Taiwan, India, and some other countries in terms of total global production. So just make sure to check with the brand that you're investigating to make sure that they are sourcing that material from US suppliers. Wool is another popular material used in a lot of bedding products, especially your warmer products like duvets and comforters. Now the US is outside of the top 10 in terms of global production of wool per year, but there still is a lot of good sourcing options because there are a lot of ranchers in the American West that are raising great sheep. In particular, the French Merino sheep is very popular here, so you should be able to find American sourced wool. And the last material cover is down feathers. So unfortunately, if you're looking at something like a down comforter, there really isn't going to be a lot of great American sourcing options for that material. The down feather market is dominated by Canada, Europe, and other Asian countries. So unfortunately, you'll maybe have to sacrifice a little bit if you're really wanting a down feather uh, bedding product, or I would just look elsewhere if you really wanna get something that's 100% made in the USA. Moving on to labeling very quickly. So I have a full explainer guide on how to read labels to find stuff that's made in the USA. So check in the cards at the top of the video as well as a link in the description below the video if you wanna go and check that out. But we do have some US legislation on our side that helps us find the country of origin on the physical product or packaging. Unfortunately, that doesn't necessarily apply to the brand's website or marketing materials. So if you're shopping online, you may have to do a little bit of digging yourself or hit us up and we'll help you find out. But otherwise, just make sure to do your research and find that country of origin for not only their assembly of the product, but also, like I mentioned earlier, the materials sourced within that product. All right, let's get into some great bedding brands that are made in the USA. Now I only have time to cover a few in today's video, so if I miss any of your favorites, make sure to leave a comment below. First up is Authenticity 50. Authenticity 50 is based in Washington State, but has a lot of manufacturing partners all over the country. They have some great signature sheets, which is what I use on my bed. Also make sure to check out their Comfort Temp Duvet and a lot of other products that are all 100% sourced in the US. Next up is American Blossom Linens. American Blossom Linens is based in Thomaston, Georgia, and it also has a great set of sheets that's actually at a pretty reasonable price for 100% organic cotton. Now, they are really transparent about their supply chain, which is amazing. They source all of their cotton from the state of Texas and then do all of their finishing and sewing and packaging and stuff like that in the Carolinas and Georgia. 
Next up is Frankenmuth Woolen Mills. Frankenmuth Woolen Mill is based in Michigan and has been manufacturing in the US since 1894. They have a very popular comforter that is hand tied and made from wool that is sourced from a lot of ranches in California. Next up is Victor Mill. Victor Mill is based in Greenville, South Carolina, and if you're looking for a really high quality bedspread, these guys are it. They have some really good traditional options, so if you're looking for something of that variety, they have a lot of colors and styles to choose from, so definitely check out Victor Mill. And last brand I'll mention in today's video is Cozy Pure. They're based in Virginia and manufacture some high quality sheet sets and a wool comforter. All right, now let's get to some of the big brands in the industry and where they're actually made. First up are bowl and branch sheets made in the USA. And the answer is no, some of their products are finished in the US, but they source pretty much all of their cotton from India and also have some material sourcing partners in Portugal and Belgium. Next is Brooklinen made in the USA. Brooklinen is another popular brand that you'll see a lot of buzz and people talking about their sheets and pillows and stuff. Unfortunately, pretty much all their stuff is made in Portugal with some materials from Belgium, France, and some other countries. Next up is Parachute made in the USA. These sheets are also super popular, but unfortunately a lot of their products are made in Turkey. And lastly, watch out for Sheet Society. These guys are made in China. All right, that's it for this video on how to find bedding made in the USA. If y'all have any questions, make sure to drop a comment below or shoot us a message on allamerican.org. If you like this video, make sure to like and subscribe. And as always, thanks for supporting your country and shopping American-made. See y'all next time.